Hey guys, today I'm going to open this one of the component of EV3 which is media motor to see how the EV3 controls its component through this spatial cable and what is inside this component. So the first thing I need to do is to open up all the screw beside here and after that I will remove this case because this case tighten up both sides. So after we remove this case we can easily take out the component inside. So now I'm going to open this screw. Yes. Okay, this is the screw. So now all the screw has already removed and now I'm going to open this case. For information, here and here has a nut, so we need to open both here first to make it easy to open. So one side is already open, I'll do the same thing for another side. So here is the motor and then we need to open this small screw from both sides. Now we can get the component inside. So this is the case for the cable to plug in. You see? And it's connected. Okay, so this is what inside it. The cable connect to chips and the chips turn the protocol into the common wire so that it can easily control this motor. So here is the gear. We need something to test it. Let's take a look inside the case. It's some gear only, nothing much. Gear is useless now, this case. So, I would like to place the motor control and I'll test it. You can see the gears moving. And now I want to test the power of the wire using this multimeter.
So as you can see, in the multimeter, it shows 7.73 volt when the EV3 passing the data to the motor. I believe that all the component of EV3 has these chips because this chip convert the special protocol into the common wire which is plus and minus to control the component inside. Thanks for watching.